for watching Little Waters on Baby League. Today we're talking about how to act around a newborn. We wanted to do this video because we have realized now that we're new parents that we had no idea about anything when visiting uh, parents who just had a baby. And I think there's others out there that just don't know, like you don't know what to do, like it's this new thing. All parents are different, all families are different, all situations are different. Mm -hmm. So really this is just our perspective and just our little insight into it now that we are new parents. The first thing we would we would like to talk about is the question of when to visit. When to visit someone who just had a baby for the first time. And I think there's a couple of things that you need to think about. Some parents might want to have a bonding time with just themselves. And some parents might want their immediate family to visit right away mm -hmm. and have friends and other relatives to hold off for a little bit. And some people might be completely open to all everyone coming right away. I think it's just important for people to be aware that there are different opinions and personalities and situations. Mm -hmm. And to just kind of think about it. Like I never would have thought about that until now that we are new parents. Next, you move on to holding the baby. So I think I would always just wash my hands or sanitize before I held someone else's baby, just to, I don't know, just be safe. And some people uh, would like you to have clean hands, other people don't really care. Um, and it also depends on the type, how close you are to that person. Um, so that's just something to think about, is just like staying clean while holding a baby. And then um, just asking about like head control. I know like some babies are, have different types of head control depending on how old they are. You want to make sure that that support is there if they need it. So um, just asking about where they're at. I think crying comes up a lot. I think a lot of times yeah. visitors don't know what to do. Like the baby starts crying as soon as they're holding him or her mm -hmm. and they're wondering whether or not they should give the baby right back or if they should try and get the baby yeah. to calm down. I know when I always held a baby and it started crying I was like, uh, what do I do? I think that in those situations that what might work best, again, always different, but what might, might work best would be just to, you know, attempt to have the baby, to calm down the baby, but if it's not working, I think it's okay to be like, okay, your baby's crying. Yeah, you know? just ask like, is she okay? Like, should I keep trying to calm her down? Um, just always ask the parents, it's always the go-to. But it is always nice to have a break and yes. visitors who calm her down for you. Definitely. <laughs> you need a visitor right now? That takes us to our last thing, is don't take anything personally when you're visiting a family with a new baby. The baby crying when you're holding him or her, just don't take it personally. Don't feel like you're bad with babies. Babies cry and see. I think it's always just safest to just ask. Just yeah, communicate. Yeah, ask. Communication. Ask. Don't feel like you're being dumb or asking a stupid question. It's just, if you're not around babies, you don't know. And uh, now as parents, it's like, if someone asks us questions, it's like, oh yeah, totally. Like, yeah. it's uh, it's nice that people ask questions. Yeah. So thumbs up if you like the video. Comment below if you've had any situations where there was some like awkward visitor moments and what you guys did about it. Subscribe to Baby League if you haven't already, and we'll see you next week.